हेलो फ्रेंड्स नाइकॉन अनाउंस ए न्यू जी एफ सी कैमरा इन द रेट्रो लुक नाइकॉन जी एफ सी इज एन ए पी एस सी मिररलेस कैमरा डेट कम्बाइंस नाइकॉन्स न्यू जी लेंस माउंट विद द लुक्स एंड कंट्रोल्स डेट रिकॉल्स द कंपनीज क्लासिक एफ एम एंड एफ ई सीरीज फिल्म एस एल आर्स नाइकॉन हैज ए लॉन्ग हिस्ट्री ऑफ आइकॉनिक कैमराज एंड लेंसेज अमंग द कंपनीज रिच हिस्ट्री इज द नाइकॉन्स एफ एम टू फिल्म कैमरा फर्स्ट रिलीज इन द The 35 mm analog camera was produced until 2001. The ZFC offers many of the same key features as the Nikon Z50 wrapped in the compact stylish old school package. The ZFC even adds some new features above and beyond the Z50 which is exciting. The ZFC is not successor to the Z50 but it is not simply a differently styled alternative either. The new Z camera calls back the Nikon's analog heritage with the retro style and analog controls. Looking at the front of the Nikon ZFC, the neat old school detail is immediately evident. The camera's engraved Nikon's logo is the one Nikon used in the 1970s and 80s, which is the nice attention to the detail moving to the top of the camera. Nikon has doubled down on the physical tactile controls. The top of the camera includes dedicated ISO shutter speed and exposure compensation dials the camera's entire 100 to 51200 iso range is accessible on the iso dial plus hi1 and hi2 settings are also accessible via the dial the top of the camera does not have the space for the full information display but it does include a small window that shows you a selected aperture The ZFC does not have traditional mode dial but surrounding the ISO dial is a switch allowing the user to swap between manual aperture priority shutter priority program and auto shooting modes it is an elegant solution and efficient use of the space on the camera's top deck the top of the ZFC also includes a power switch a movie still mode switch and a dedicated movie record button The ZFC aims to deliver modern Z performance and technology in the classic design. Further, Nikon wants to ZFC to be lightweight and compact. The ZFC is constructed using a magnesium alloy frame, which provides durability without making the camera large and heavy. The ZFC weighs five grams less than the Z50. It is not a big difference in the weight, of course, but at the only 390 gram, the ZFC is a lightweight APS-C mirrorless camera. The Nikon ZFC has a satin silver coating which contrasts nicely against the leather-like black grip material covering much of the camera including the front grip area and much of the camera's rear. A neat aspect of the camera's design is that you can flip the 3 inch vary angle display such that the display is hidden. The back of the ZFC display is covered with the same black leather-like material such that when the display is reversed the ZFC has the look of the film camera which of course lack a rear display speaking of the rear display the ZFC display is a 3 inch and and has approximately 1.04 billion dots of resolution the display flips out to the side allowing it to be used as a selfie display the vary angle display should also prove useful for vloggers allowing them to easily frame shots and monitor their videos The display has 11 manual brightness level and offers 170 degree viewing angle. The touch screen can be used to interact with the camera menus, shooting settings and more as well. Above the display is a series of buttons which are finished in the satin silver. There are playback, delete and monitor display buttons to the left of the viewfinder. To the viewfinder right are an AE AF lock button and command dial. To the right of the display are information zoom in zoom out display and menu buttons there is a directional pad with a central okay button the zfc does not include a dedicated autofocus point joystick which is also absent on the z50 the zfc electronic viewfinder is a 0.39 inch type oled display with the resolution of 2.36 million dots The EVF offers 100% frame coverage and has a 1.02x magnifications. Overall, the ZFC is arguably Nikon's most stylish Z camera yet. Based on appearance alone, the camera promises to the bridge the gap between Nikon's storied past and its mirrorless Z system present. The ZFC has the same imaging pipeline as the Z50, meaning that the ZFC comes equipped with the 20.9 megapixel CMOS image sensor paired with the Nikon's Xperia 6 ML processor
Its native ISO range is 100 to 51200 which can be expanded up to ISO 204800 I2. The camera includes auto ISO which automatically select ISO from 100 to 25600 which can be further customized to the user preference. ZFC offers the same shooting performance as the Z50 as well as providing up to 11 frames per second continuous shooting mode when recording 12-bit RAW images. The ZFC includes the same 209-point hybrid autofocus system as the Z50 although with some improvements. The 209 autofocus points cover approximately 87% of the frame in the horizontal direction and 85% vertically. The autofocus system is rated to work down to the minus 4.5 EV. Autofocus area modes include pinpoint autofocus, single point autofocus, dynamic area autofocus, wide area autofocus S, wide area autofocus L, wide area autofocus L people, wide area autofocus L animal, auto area autofocus, auto area autofocus people and autofocus area animals. The ZFC includes a couple of autofocus features that the Z50 doesn't, including full-time eye autofocus when recording the video and wide area autofocus for the people and animal. Having full-time eye autofocus when recording video plus the very angle display makes the ZFC Nikon best camera for vlogging and webcam users. The ZFC records 4K UHD 3840 by 2160 video at up to the 30p. 4K UHD video can be also recorded at 24p and 25p. 4K UHD video is recorded using the full width of the image sensor and with the full pixel readout. Full HD 1920 by 1080 video can be recorded at 24, 25, 30, 50, 60, 100 and 120p frame rates. In terms of slow motion video, the ZFC offers in the camera 4x and 5x slow motion modes. The camera also has a built-in interval timer for the creation of 4K time-lapse movies. During the video shooting, the ZFC does not include the body image stabilization, but an electronic VR mode is available for the video. Using Nikon's free webcam utility app, the ZFC can easily be used as a webcam too. It uses the same EN-EL25 lithium-ion battery as the Z50. The ZFC includes built-in the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth via its wireless connection. The ZFC like the Z6 II and the Z7 II can be updated wirelessly via the Nikon Snapbridge application. This is the another feature that ZFC has that Z50 doesn't. Nikon Snapbridge can also wirelessly control the camera and automatically transfer images from the camera to your mobile devices. The ZFC has a high speed USB and micro B connector, a type D HDMI connector, stereo mini jack and, and USB 3.2. The Nikon ZFC comes in the standard silver and blacker however through Nikon USA and other Nikon stores worldwide the ZFC will also be available in the other colors. There are 6 additional colors all of which will be available in the United States and the Canada. These additional colors include white, coral pink, mint green, sand beige, umber brown and natural grey. The Nikon ZFC is available as a body only but it will be available in a couple of kits including one with the Nikon ZDX 60x50mm f3.5 6.3 VR lens. This lens will be available along with the ZFC with, with the matching satin silver finish. It is the same lens optically as the earlier black version released with the Z50 but the smallest Nikon G lens will have a new style to match the ZFC look. Pricing and availability The Nikon ZFC will be available starting in the late July in a numerous configurations. The body only will be the cost approx. Dollar nine sixty USD dollar for dollar eleven hundred customer can purchase the GFC with the special silver sixteen fifty mm kit lens. The silver DX sixty to fifty mm will also be available separately for the dollar three hundred. While the GFC and G fifty are the similar in the many ways, there are some obvious difference between the two cameras. Beyond the massive differences in the style, the GFC include improved usability via a full vary angle display and improved dial operations. In the terms of the feature, the ZFC offers USB power delivery and wireless firmware updates. Two feature the G50 doesn't include. That said, the Z50 include a built-in pop-up flash, something not available in the GFC. The ZFC and Z50 use the same autofocus system 
but Z F C includes the eye autofocus in the movie wide area autofocus people and animal autofocus feature unavailable in the Z50 the Z F C also includes exposure composition is auto mode a useful feature unavailable for the G50 users that's all for the day soon i will come with the new video thanks for watching